Number six, two times this bit squared minus eight equals zero. Well, let's solve this by moving the eight over to start. Add eight, add eight. So we're going to have two times this n minus seven bit squared equals an eight. Now I know I can see two times a four gives me eight. So I know this n minus seven squared bit is going to come out to be a four. Well, how do I get rid of multiplying by two? I divide by two divide by two, and I now have what I just said. Hey, this guy's going to have to be a four. I need to get rid of that square. What do we do? We take the square root. When I take the square root, it crosses out the squaring. Now, what is the square root of four? It's a two or negative two, because remember, you got to have the positive part and the negative part. So we have a positive two, or it could be a negative two. So we take our n minus seven, we set it equal to the positive 2. We take our n minus 7, and we set it equal to the negative 2 and solve. Get our two solutions. One solution, 9. Here, add 7, add 7, or 5. There's our answers. And this, again, as I always say, it's crossing at 5 or 9. This parabola swinging down and crossing in those spots.